federal support that the ALSI's bucket challenge has garnered unprecedented support and awareness for the ALS community. We all have to thank Peter Freights for coming up with the challenge to make ALS a relevant topic. This has been a fun way to get the world talking about ALS. However, I want to challenge everybody to not only talk or to just accept the ice bucket challenge, but to give. Please go to my website, brigandsbrigade.org, to make a donation to help us fight ALS. Keep the ice buckets dumping, everybody. Well, that was recently released by the Ravens. You can see O.J. Brigance with a big thank you for all the attention that's being paid to ALS right now uh, via the Ice Bucket Challenge. And, you know, we talked about this. We've seen his story before. We were introduced to him during the Super Bowl run. If you're not inspired by who he is and the way he's approached this, then you, you will not be inspired. You know what else? was? He mentioned Pete Freights. Pete Freights uh, went to Boston College and I have some mutual friends with him. He actually is one that started this Ice Bucket Challenge kind of out of Boston, another guy dealing with ALS. And um, I don't think you just see the impact of somebody that's struggling so much, but then the impact that they have starting that Ice Bucket Challenge Pete Freights does it. People don't know who he is. Now, O.J. Berantz is talking about him on NFL Live. See the commissioner, team owners doing that. It's pretty remarkable, um, the impact that those guys have had, and obviously the response by so many people. We are seeing this go around NFL teams. That's Rex Ryan, of course, the New York Jets accepting the Ice Bucket Challenge. Also, I believe, the New England Patriots. And we've really seen teams. There's going to be fewer that haven't done it here pretty soon. Uh, then have well it, it, it's raising awareness and really that's what oj begrants is doing to you know we might be able to save people down the road uh, from suffering from this dreaded disease of als but um everyone's involved it's it's a great thing that the awareness is there now people got to make a donation that's right as Help we said research. write the checks yeah. because that's yeah. really how you make a difference and that's the point. most important thing and like, like you said though if you the more powerful of the two videos to me this is this is excellent but to see oj and to see him as as, as encouraging it is as it is is to watch him go through what he's going through with the courage that he is it it, it does make you want to make sure that I, you don't take things for granted yeah and, and I, I do think it is important and that that when you see people whether it's John Mara you know have water poured over his head that, that John Mara an owner of the New York Giants can then be in a situation and say you know what I'm actually and I have enough power and enough respect around the National Football League I'm going to challenge Bill Belichick and Robert Kraft to do it. And guess what? They Those did guys it. then did it. end yeah. up doing yeah. it. And so the, the way that it's you know, almost a pay-it-forward mentality to, to have this NFL, which has so much popularity, yes. do such a good thing when we hear so many bad stories in the offseason – uh, you know, about, you know, guys getting in trouble and doing all that type of thing. To the see guys doing the positive right thing news. Is good. You know, what makes O.J. Bergant's great in some ways is that he said, hey, don't pity me. I'm going to do the things I've done before. He's going to play fantasy football, by the way. He's not giving that up. Fantasy football drafts coming up.